What would this great sport be without derby passion? Two teams who know plenty about each other, but aren't very fond of each other. It's Liverpool, they face Manchester United, and it's live on EA TV. And I must say, this stadium falls in the must-visit category for any football fan should the chance come his or her way. Anfield is the venue. I'm Derek Ray, ready to bring you match commentary, and alongside me is Stuart Robson. And today could well be the day when the league title is clinched. It is Liverpool up against Manchester United. Well, what a game this promises to be. Speaking to the fans outside the stadium, they're in buoyant mood, full of expectation that they'll be celebrating come the final whistle. Let's hope they can hold their nerve here. Starting lineup for Liverpool. Alisson gets the nod in goal. Andrew Robertson starts with Trent Alexander Arnold in the fullback positions. And leading the attack today is Roberto Firmino. And here's the lineup for Manchester United. Davi De Gea begins in goal. Fred plays with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. And Bart Veghorst is the striker. Here's how Liverpool are lining up. Number one, Alisson. Number 66, Trent Alexander Arnold. Thank you for attending Anfield. Enjoy the match. And now they get the ball rolling. Veghorst. Henderson has it. Well, lovely work to get past his man. A wonderful intervention. Well, a victory for Liverpool in the last game against Manchester City. What do you expect this time around, Stuart? Yes, to win away from home, you have to perform well. And their attacking play was excellent. And when you look at the two teams today, I'd expect them to win again. They should be too strong for their opponents here. And so a look at the table. And while they have time on their side with a win today, Stuart, they'll be crown champions. Well, Derek, they just need to perform as they've done for most of the season. Get the win and then they can celebrate. They certainly deserve it. Now they stopped them in their tracks. Jaden Sancho. Wasteful from United. Space on the flank. Useful looking position, you've got to say. In with a chance. Oh, he's done it. And we might just have witnessed the goal that secures the title. Well, what a moment that could turn out to be. They've just got to defend well now. Just look at this again. The combination play in the top third of the field was so precise. And Salah does the rest. He strikes it so cleanly. He hits it with power and accuracy. There was no stopping that.
So back in action, and it's up to United now to be inventive. A move of promise on the flank. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Well, it looked highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. Shaw. Bruno Fernandes has it. Jadon Sancho. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. Well, those stats don't lie. Liverpool haven't controlled the ball, but they've certainly shown an ability to counter-attack when they win it back. I expect more of the same. I think it's been a really good performance from them so far. Yes, a really effective performance all in all. No worries for the keeper. Liverpool have given it away. This is Thiago. And a textbook interception. Advantage, Manchester United. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Weghorst. And the keeper more than equal to the task. Salah. Henderson has it. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. And just one minute of time added on for stoppages. Anthony. Well, there's the half-time whistle, and it's all going swimmingly. They're just 45 minutes away from being crowned champions today. Well, what a position to be in. They just need to perform well in this second half, and as you said, they will be the champions, and fully deserved, I would say. They've been excellent this season. And the match is underway. And the second half underway. Liverpool looking to build upon a largely positive first half showing. Salah! And there it is, a goal! It's just possible that might be the one that wins them the title. Well, look at the celebrations. They certainly believe so. Still a job to do, but surely they won't threat away from this position. Well, just look at this again. He moves the ball quickly, he gets beyond his marker, and he keeps his composure. It's an excellent finish. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. <laughs> Playing advantage here, United keep it. And possession lost, intercepted. Thiago now, what's he going to do from this position? Chance here! And he's only gone and made it a hat-trick! Absolutely unplayable today! What a performance! Well, let's have a look at the replay. What a through ball this is by Thiago, and what a clever bit of play it is from Salah, both with his movement and his finish. That's a nice goal. again it does appear that Liverpool are just about out of sight Manchester United keep the ball advantage substitution for Liverpool coming off the pitch immaculately placed by Casemiro well it looked like a good ball but cut out in the end pressing high to win the ball Casemiro Diogo Dallo on the ball. Takes it on. And inches away. Didn't miss by very much at all. Here's a change for Manchester United.
Well, just to point you in the right direction, we have more live action from the Premier League coming up here on EA TV. It's Liverpool facing Crystal Palace. Firmino. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Fernandes. That's useful play. Really poor timing, and some will argue that he was asking for a yellow card. Now the referee saw it as a bookable offence. And I think he's got it absolutely right. That was a poor challenge, you have to say. Well, he's going to be cross with himself straight into that human barrier. Substitution for Liverpool. And they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. And taken short. A gift for any goalkeeper. Well, nearly at full time, not quite. And it's all going Liverpool's way, Stuart. Well, the result has never really been in doubt, has it? They've created so many chances with some brilliant attack in play. I think they've looked an outstanding team today. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Difficult to stop him. And Thiago. Determined defending. Marcus Rashford. Thiago distributing shrewdly. Well, not great on the accuracy front. Goal kick here. And United will switch things around personnel wise. Number 15. Not much time to make up his mind. And the referee is going to add on four added minutes. Rashford. Return to Sancho. And reading it absolutely superbly. And the referee has blown for full time. It's official now. The champions have been crowned. Well, if you win the league, Derek, you've been the best team. And they certainly have been. And what great scenes we're seeing. Just look at the joy down there. They fully deserve this. They've been magnificent. The goal to be the best team in the league. And they've hit the target. Well, they certainly have. They've been consistent, they've been relentless, they've been outstanding. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. Well, this is special for everybody at the club. What a great moment for any young player. And this is what you dream about when you start playing football. When you're playing in the playground, you want to win a cup. Brilliant moment. It's a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Well, you can just see what it means to those players and the manager. That's fantastic stuff. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. Full marks to the entire team, and now they get the chance to exhale and enjoy. They've been brilliant in this competition, and so have the fans. They've really got behind their team. They've played a big part in this win. Just look at those faces in the crowd. Great stuff. And really a match made in heaven between players and fans. And these celebrations are going to continue for quite some time.
And now the players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken. Well, these photos will be cherished for years to come, won't they? Certainly ones to show the grandchildren.